Dear students of grade 10, uh, today we will discuss all the exercise of reading 1, uh, that is London versus Paris. Uh, today in, in today's class, uh, we will solve all the exercise of this unit. Uh, here we have first exercise, uh, find the words from the text and fill in the crossword puzzle. And uh, students, so you have to find the right word from the text and you have to fill the crossword puzzle, puzzle here. So downside we have downward. The first one is uh, number one. A person who lives in a town. Uh, what is the right word here? Arbinate. Okay. Arbinate is the right word. And uh, similarly, the phone number an impressive display of a particular type of thing. That is array. And uh, number six, it's a down downward. In accordance uh, with the highest standard faultless this is impeccable and uh, last is seven number impaired by lack of recent practice that is rusty now cross side number two a person who approaches passes uh, by in the street asking for donation and uh, we can say chugger or bagger also but chugger is the right word number three a set of rays, uh, rails that forms uh, the root of the stream that is stream V full of energy and life vibrant and number eight a long narrow french law that is buckety the uh, me uh, wickety it's a french law it's a bread and the art of choosing cooking uh, cooking and eating good food that is gastronomy and a food and culture the last one is uh, number 10 a small close knit group of people that is click use so this is uh, all about your crossword puzzle now move to next exercise in next exercise uh, b number choose the correct alternatives and you have to choose the right uh, answer uh, first one is uh, the transport network is london in london is dot dot it's widespread is the right answer and b number the number of museum in london is how many museums are in london it's a 240 museum are in London and C number Paris is better and has more to offer than London in terms of in terms of uh, variety of cuisine Paris is better than London and uh, and D number which of the following is not the major attraction of Paris uh, which of the following is not it's a public library public library is the right answer and the last one is uh, which of the following is not the similar between the two cities so which of uh, the following is not the similar one it's both cities can be traveled all the year around with nice weather the similarity uh, is that uh, the anyone can travel all the year around with nice weather it's all about your exercise number b now it's time to solve exercise c the state whether the true and false statement uh, number one is the french prefer handshake to kisses it's fall they prefer to kiss okay and uh, people in london are easy to get along with it's a false and uh, c number the french enjoy taking informally in espresso bar it's a true and d number london is almost 15 times larger than paris in terms of geography no it's false and e number is uh, the cost of living in paris is almost the same as that of london no the cost of living is uh, much cheaper than london in paris that's a false statement the last you know is uh, if you are looking for a less populous city then paris would be perfect no both uh, uh, paris are is having you know highly populated city and uh, uh, that's why it's a false statement and now d number question the answer now these are some questions given here that you have to answer from the text so students if you have uh, read the text carefully then you will be able to answer the question here but i have written the uh, answer of all this question have a look at the answer uh, here is the answer students answer number first is here uh, the popular you know first question is the what are the famous river in london and paris what are the famous river there are two rivers one is thames in london and the uh, again uh, sani river in the 
पेरिस वाई डू पीपल बी नंबर वाई डू फुटबॉल फैंस प्रेफर लंदन टू पेरिस वाई डू पीपल प्रेफर लंदन टू पेरिस बिकॉज देर आर मैनी फुटबॉल क्लब्स इन लंदन एंड डेट्स वाई पीपल प्रेफर टू लंदन दैन पेरिस हेयर इज द आंसर ऑल्सो सिंस लंदन हैज सिक्स मेजर फुटबॉल क्लब्स बट इन पेरिस देर इज ओनली वन मेजर फुटबॉल क्लब एंड सी नंबर विच ऑफ द टू सिटीज वॉज विजिटेड बाई मोर टूरिस्ट इन टू थाउजेंड एंड एटीन सो हेयर इज द आंसर सी नंबर आंसर इज हेयर अकॉर्डिंग टू टू थाउजेंड एटीन रिपोर्टेड बाई मास्टर कार्ड द विद इन द कंटेंट लंदन रिकॉर्ड द मोस्ट नंबर ऑफ टूरिस्ट दैन आफ्टर बैंकॉक मीन्स लंदन टू सेकेंड प्लेस आफ्टर बैंकॉक इन टर्म्स ऑफ टूरिस्ट इन टू थाउजेंड एंड एटी रिपोर्ट बाई मास्टर कार्ड एंड द डी नंबर वट टाइम ऑफ इयर इज सुटेबल टू विजिट इट ओके वट इज द सुटेबल टाइम टू विजिट इन लंदन सो आई थिंक ऑटम इज डिपेक्टेड एज द सुटेबल सीजन टू विजिट द लंदन बिकॉज टेम्परेचर एंड ऑल वॉम एंड वंडरफुल एट दैट टाइम हाँ ये नंबर विच ऑफ द टू सिटी इज चीपर येस आई थिंक विच वी हैव आई वी हैव स्टडीड इन द टेक्स अकॉर्डिंग टू टेक्स फ्रांस फ्रांस इज चीपर दैन लंदन एंड एफ नंबर वे डू यू थिंक इट्स इजियर टू कैच द कैप इन लंदन और पेरिस वाई येस अकॉर्डिंग द कंटेंट अकॉर्डिंग द टैक्स पेरिस पेरिस इज एसेसिबल वे आर सेवेंटीन थाउजेंड एंड दिस टैक्सीज आर वे आर लंदन हैज Twenty-two thousand and five hundred registered taxes and taxes. So it's a simple to capture cab in London. So more number of uh, no numbers of taxes are in London. That's why it's very easy to capture tax uh, capture a taxi in London than Paris. The next exercise that is E number. Which of the two cities would you like to visit or give reason? If you have to visit uh, uh, one city. uh which one would you like to visit okay out of two you will choose one city and you have to give a reason here and uh, here i have uh, written the answer of this question here with the reason yes yeah, surely i would like to visit london the city may be a dissolving part of society make it dynamic as uh, students i prefer to visit london and uh, uh, what uh, do you know what city do you prefer to visit then you can discuss in your friend with your friends and in in the class so this is what i have written here and you can write from here now i move to next exercise exercise students we have speaking part and speaking uh, there are some pictures given here and uh, one is traditional house you can see and second one is it's a modern house is here the picture of modern house and tradition house is given here and first uh, look at the picture uh, look at the following picture and study the way they are compared and contrast you know so uh, here is the comparison and uh, here is a conversation also uh, between roshan and sujita and wow the house is exceptionally beautiful but the first one is first one is smaller than the other one means first one is smaller than the other one means there is a comparison that one is smaller than other then sujita yes the first house is not as big okay then sujita uh, she again says that first one is not as big okay as the other however it looks more attic and then the second one but it looks you know modern than the second one so this is how you can make a conversation and in that conversation you can do comparison between the picture so here is exercise in b number we have that uh, we have to Uh, make a similar conversation in you know okay in a pair using suitable adjectival uh, adjectival phrases here the first one is here that is long attractive to look at white so here are again here two pictures are given here uh, one is a picture of this is a koshi bridge and second one is karnali bridge and uh, <coughs> and then second you can have you can you can see big easy lamb you know picture of two dogs here again Uh, C number, uh, C number, clean, economical to run. Uh, one is uh, we have uh, that is coal fire and electric heater. So uh, students, you have to uh, make a pair of conversation where you uh, you will do compare. You know, you will do comparison between these the pictures given here. 
so i have solved the exercise here and uh, look at have a look at the answer of this exercise first one is we have a uh, long attractive to look at while loop okay here are two bridges uh one a long attractive to look at it's a karnali bridge and kursi bridge so i have uh, made conversation with raj and ram wow both bridges look magnificent but the kursi bridge is longer than the karnali bridge so here i have compared that kursi is longer than karnali now, ram yes karnali bridge isn't as long as kursi bridge in any case it's more uh, allowing to see at the then kursi bridge it's more extensive than the kursi bridge as well means in terms of beauty and all the karnali is uh, a more beautiful than kosi but the in terms of length and the kosi bridge is longer than karnali this is how we compare these two bridges and the second one is uh, big easy to lamb here you know there are two uh, you know picture of two dogs here and uh, here is the again conversation appear of conversation here the raj wow both uh, dogs seem extraordinary leonberg is greater than the you know here i have mentioned the uh species of dog and a variety of dog you know one is leon bog and second one is bull terrier ram yes bull terrier isn't as enormous as uh, leon bog in any case it's simpler to tame but leon bog is more busy than bull terrier so this is the comparison between uh, these two dogs and uh, c number clean emotional to run again uh, we have electric heater and coal fire again here uh, you can uh, here is a conversation uh, among these two i think an electric radiator is cleaner than a coal fire yes coal fire isn't as clean as electric radiator so comparison that the coal fire is not as clean okay uh, as electric heater so this is the comparison and the last one is we have uh, pleasant to shop at wide range of good corner shop and supermarket so again in this uh, picture we have to compare these two pictures one is uh, supermarket and second one is uh, one is uh, corner goods corner so among these two i think a corner shop is more wonderful to shop at a corner store ram yes a grocery store isn't as uh, charming uh, to shop as a corner shop be that uh, as it uh, may it includes a more extensive range of products accessible than other corner shop so this is a uh, how we have compared all these pictures in this exercise students it's all your speaking part now move to the grammar one so grammar one we have uh, choose the correct adjective or adverb or complete the following sentences so again you have to choose the correct adjective or adverb here so i have solved the exercise here and uh, you can uh, write from here and uh, now again uh, we have uh, again new exercise again i choose the correct from the form of the adjective or the ad adverb given in the bracket and rewrite the sentence again we have to rewrite the sentence uh, here i have written uh, some people think that the sanskrit language is much so complicated is the verb more complicated is it's adjective okay it's a uh, comparative form of adjective the metal then heavy then heavier okay then wood as heavy the, then uh, he has a quickly more quickly intelligent then intelligent and better well better okay and the uh, fast as fast beautiful more beautiful so these are some form of adjective that we have used to fill in the blank here uh, in order to compare the things or person so in writing part we have uh, or write a couple of paragraph comparing or uh, comparing our capital city kathmandu with any other city so in this exercise you have to compare the kathmandu city with any other uh, city of you uh, know in nepal so here i have written the answer of this exercise so here is the comparison i have written uh, comparison of kathmandu and pokhara okay these are the four most well known cities of nepal so there are uh, many differences uh, between these two cities that i have mentioned in the uh, here so students you can take the help and you can write from here so it's all about your exercise and solution of this unit with that i come to an end of today's class students see you in the next one have a good day my dear students